You left your job for this? How can you live security? Have you thought about you it? You are making a huge mistake. What if you don't make it? My way is the best way. You know what I've been thinking of? Comfort. And how it can quickly become a wolf in sheep's clothing. Something that is very crucial and defining when we grow up. We cultivate an instinct to pursue it. Because it reminds us of safety, security and warmth of a motherly bosom. People build their existence in a search for that cozy blanket, reassurance of things staying the same. After all, you and me were created in a way to conserve that life energy as much as possible. Adventures can be tricky, they can definitely be risky. Stepping onto uncharted territories messes with your survival instinct. And it doesn't matter that we live under safe circumstances, our psyche is still that of a caveman. Nothing in life is for free, there is always a trade-off, like the law of energy conservation. If you get an opportunity for something that seems enticing, a rational way would be to think of the drawbacks. I have never been compelled by security. Somehow the feeling of emptiness was always prevailing. Is there something wrong with me? Why don't I want the same things like everyone else? <sighs> then it hit me. Sad faces, tired postures, grunting noises, expressions of despair and hopelessness. Do I want that for myself? If the normal is to be miserable, disregard me from that list. Recognizing that we all are born unique, but most die mediocre. The process is slow and stealthy. Comfort does that as anyone who left a legacy followed someone else. I don't think so. Greatness paves own path, taking the risk of being proclaimed insane to have everyone cheering you after success. One friend of mine once told me, what do you mean Arnold did that? He's one in a million. I refuse to be something else than that. Not for others, not to prove something for people, but to create a profound life for my own well-being. Comfort makes you to abandon your integrity, put on the shackles of safety and slowly lose yourself to the promised land, where everything is green and peachy. No worries do arise, you feel at home. Nah, that's not the reality I see. Stress and bitterness intensify as John and Jane Doe grow older. They stray further away from the life picture they have envisioned when they were kids. Comfort is a slow poison, it runs through the veins, makes you addictive, consuming and hoarding. Comfort is a distraction, blurs your vision and makes you forget your true calling. <sighs> Comfort is heavy, hanging down from your shoulders, paralyzing you in the face of challenges, whispering about the dangers of the world into your ear, convincing you to do the bare minimum. Comfort makes you stagnant, forget about growth and lose mobility. Life is a movement and you better keep moving. Comfort is a luxury of kings and queens. You better build your own castle and establish own kingdom. Real comfort befalls when you own your time and spend it on your terms. Until then, I'll be keeping comfort at least on a safe distance, so that I know what I'm fighting for.